Welcome back. It is time for our EMOM day. Now, I said, we, you know, I was talking through 30-minute EMOM, and then I started thinking about the workout today, and I think I came up with a solution that I like a little bit more. We're doing a 20-minute workout. We're going to warm up ahead of time, but we're going to go based off of a style of workout um, that's pretty traditional from my background, and I thought that's why it would be fun, by the way. Let me close this. Um, that's why I thought it would be fun is it's a 20 minute workout typically. And the workout is in 20 minutes, as many rounds as possible of five pull-ups, 10 pushups, 15 air squats. Now, often that workout can be done in a format of five, 10, 15 on the minute, every minute, but that's a lot. There, there's a heavy volume to that. So I had an idea that I want to play around with on today's workout, and it's going to be on minute one, we're going to be doing five pull-ups, 10 push-ups. Now, obviously, if you don't have pull-ups, that's more than fine. Um, you're going to be doing a some kind of banded row or a pull, which can be done with a towel wrapped around something that is immovable, um, where you can actually be rowing yourself on the object. Uh, things that I could think of that could do that would be if you had like a fence post, uh, something immobile in a house, if you had like a pillar in your house, um, you may even be able to, if you could take a towel, throw it over a door, close the door so the door's locked, and then you could be doing a row like that. That's the equivalent of the pull-up, okay? Then 10 push-ups, again, modified as always on the push-up. Elevate the surface to make the push-up easier for you, and then 15 uh, air squats. But what we're gonna do is every minute on the minute for 20 minutes, we're going to do five pull-ups, 10 push-ups. Then we are going to go to, the, uh, on minute one, minute two, We'll do 15 air squats, five pull-ups. Then on minute three, so essentially we're just gonna pick up where we left off each round. So each round will be a combination of two of the movements based off of how we're moving through it. I hope that makes sense. Um, okay, with that being said, I just wanted to quickly brief you guys as to what we were doing for the workout. And uh, by the way, it's so hot here today. Uh, those of us that are in SoCal, I'm sure you guys are picking up on that. Uh, Danny, first to comment today. Robbie, welcome, happy you're here today. We missed you yesterday. NorCal reporting from Leah. Um, Kim, good morning from Los Angeles. Kim, is it as warm up there it is, as it is down here in uh, Southern, Southern California? Uh, Joao, hello everyone. Hope everyone's doing well. Leslie, hi, amigos. Happy to catch this live workout. Brighten up this gloomy Seattle day. Ron Morris, good afternoon, everyone. Kevin Ring, set up and ready for this one. Cool. Um, Cork, Ireland. Love it, Kevin. Smash that like button, guys. You know what to do once you're here. Or see hi, everyone. Uh, Simone is, hey, from North Carolina. Simone is, haven't seen you in a while. Welcome back. Robbie Dunn, thanks for the reminder. Erica, hello all from Central Illinois, ready for 30-minute EMOM. I hope the 20 minutes going to be okay, but I have a feeling after 20 minutes, y'all are going to be like, okay, this is, I'm smoked. Uh, where's Denise? Hope she's okay. Why do I feel like I remember her saying she might not make it today? Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon to you, Scott and family. Danny, Erica, I also hope that it'll be a 30-minute EMOM. Hi, everyone. Danny, yep. Uh, no, Denise needs some hydration tips. Uh, hubby and me wishing everyone a great weekend from Southeast New Mexico. Janita, happy you're here. Uh, Elizabeth, hello, Bend, Oregon. Yo, Shane Oviedo, Strength CrossFit. What's up, Kitch? Kitch is here, everybody. Say hi. Um, Danny, sorry, no way to do some row. What can I do? So you don't have a towel, Danny? There's no, like, towel in your house anywhere? Um, uh, Denise running... In the door, panting. Did I miss anything? Hydrate, please. Uh, sell love. Yes, yeah, SoCal, baby. Hit, yeah. Uh, hi, Denise. Hey, Denise. I started to be worried. Sophia De Silva Hobson made it, everyone. Uh, yes, so hot. Sophia, are you doing the workout uh, as well? Whole family's back today. Joao Denise is here. Michael, hi. Uh, waiting for my Concept 2 delivery. Good for you for actually getting on a concept, getting a Concept 2, getting hands on. Hello from Montreal. Uh, no place to wrap it around. Danny, nowhere to wrap it. Okay, um, I will think of something before we get started. Sophia's doing it. Yes, hi from Spain. Uh, Jose Maria Sanchez Toledano, welcome. Um, so guys, uh, I, uh, yeah. Anyways, so the workout today, 5, 10, 15. Simple in rep schemes, simple in movements. The only thing, obviously, we may need to modify for is some kind of pull. Um, in the instance that we don't have anything to pull from, Danny, if you have a weighted object of some kind, which I think you've been able to identify, um, is I would love you to do a heavy bent over row if you can. And because 
The bent over row can be a little bit easier in positioning. I might have you 10 bent over rows as opposed to uh, five pull-ups. Uh, hi from Escher, England. Just had my skier delivered. Ooh, good for you. Uh, Rebecca, oh my God, Michael, I don't want to know what you had to do to get a concept two right now. That's a great, that's a great point. Sophia, where's the smash button? YouTube challenge. <laughs> okay. Sophia, it's not a smash button. It's smash the like button. It's just a little thumbs up. Um, so yeah. And often if you exit, if you go out of the comments, uh, or like turn your phone vertical, you'll see the like button and you can like it. <laughs> I like the smash button though. I uh, love the Dark Horse videos. Keep it up. Planning on it. Cool. I'll do it with dumbbells. So I love, uh, yeah, got a good laugh out of it. Okay. So let's get a little bit of a warm up here, guys. And then we're going to get straight into this workout. Again, um, this one is going to be 20 minutes because 30 minutes, in my opinion, is going to end up in a pretty high volume, um, which to me, I think, you doing okay? What's wrong? Um, I don't like the mean guy. Oh, you don't like the mean guy? Okay, should I skip it? Yeah. Okay. Do you want me to back up to the beginning? Yeah. yeah. How's that? Yeah. Cool, good. We're all set on the movie over here. As you guys know, Friday's daddy days. So, um, okay, so oh, let's get some warm up going. Oh, and why we're not doing 30 minute EMOM is just because of that volume, as because many of these body weight exercises, pull ups, right? If we did 30 minutes, that just gets to be a lot. And I could have done 30 minutes with one movement every minute, but I just don't think that's going to keep our heart rate high enough. This is going to keep your heart rate and your breathing rate elevated pretty solidly uh, through a good part of the workout. So uh, next up, kid lifts. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let's just start for our warm up. I just want to make sure I don't smash my arms or anything here. Um, we're just going to start with some nice arm throws. So what I would like is stand, from a standing position, I would just want you to toss your arms down and just relax as you toss them down. We're going to do 10 of these. All right, once you've done that, toss them up. So I'm sweating already just from standing here. I don't know if you guys can see the sweat on my shirt. This is just from standing here, not even moving yet. All right, now we're gonna take the arms across the body. So just rotating which arm goes over the top. We're gonna do 10 of these, 10 uh, crossovers. I'm a little sore from push-ups the other day. All right, next we're going to go into a scap push-up. So a scap push-up, just as a reminder, if I were in the push-up position, it's simply keeping the elbows locked out, keeping the belly braced, and then letting the shoulder blades draw together and spreading them apart again from the ground position. So drop down into that push-up position. And we're just gonna do 10 scap push-ups. It's not a whole lot of range of motion. Once you're down here, take yourself into down dog, pedal it out. Daddy? Yes, sweetie. What do you need? There's a strap. Up top. Okay. <laughs> oh, so nice. Bring it on up. Walk those feet to the hands. Give yourself a nice just bent over forward fold. By the way, how is everybody feeling after yesterday's mobility? I'm curious, how did your bodies enjoy the rest of the day after that 40-minute mobility work? Um, Denise, I cannot tell why I have my knee propped up and I'm cruising the couch today, but I will do it later. Do I have a fan? I should get one for the garage for sure. Just try the 7-minute 2K. So I'll do this tomorrow. Agonizingly close. Oh, 7 oh, 3 No. No, so close. Um, Oviedo, more stuff like that, as in like more stretching. Is that what you mean? Um, okay, we'll get a little bit more stretching in then as requested. All right, so from this position, guys, please, we're going to walk out now. In, we're going to inchworm out. We're actually going to do some inchworms. Instead of just a standing forward fold, walk those hands out. 
into a nice, long, stretched-out plank, hang for a second, and then walk the hands, keeping the elbows straight, back to the feet. What I want you to think about is basically using your shoulders like legs, right? Use your arms like legs as you're walking. Walk those hands out. Hang, get stretched out. And use your arms to walk back to your feet. Let's do one more of those. Good work, those hands. Back to the feet. Hang one more time while we're here. And while you're here, just give me a nice, gentle rock back and forth. Just nothing forcing it. Just moving. Enjoying a little bit of dangle. All right. Now from here, stay in this position. Grab your toes. Drop and pull your butt down into a squat. So you're sitting in the bottom of a squat now. Pull that chest up so you're pulling on your toes. Arms are long inside the knees. Take that right arm, reach up, bring it back down. Left arm, reach up, back down. Right arm, reach up. And just give me five per side. That's two. Oh, there's a pop. Oh. Okay, from this position, take those hands, put them up, and just hang out in the bottom of the squat here, trying to keep those, once you take your thumbs, drive them to the wall behind you, sitting in the squat. Okay, now take your hands, place them on your head, and I want you to duck walk forward for me as far as you can, and make your way towards me, or back and away from me, that works too. All right, from here, just give me 10 air squats. I'm gonna get back into camera range. Keeping the hands on the head. Nine and 10. Okay, now I want you to find whatever your pull-up option is going to be. For me, I'm lucky I have an actual pull-up bar here. If you've got one, great. If not, you're just gonna use whatever your pull-up's gonna be. If you have a band, you're gonna be doing banded rows. If you have a towel, loop it around something. You're gonna be doing towel rows. If you don't have anything that you can latch around like Danny, you're gonna grab some kind of weighted object. And you're gonna do a bent over row for today's pull, okay? Think of it that way. All we're trying to do is a pull of some kind, okay? Hi, sweets. Yes. You want a band? You want you want the yellow one? You want we'll call this the Kenny the uh, the the my daughter band. Sound good? <laughs> She's got the band, everybody. Okay, so from your from your pull, quote unquote pull. Um, let's see, something to shoot for superheroes. You'll get there. Uh, more stuff like that. Next time, left myself with too much to do at the end. 19 seconds off the last time. I'm really enjoying the different instructional videos on the Dark Horse page. Awesome superheroes. That's fantastic. I can't wait to see in the crew where you can actually get into one of our 2K programs and see how fast you can get when you use a dedicated effort, like four weeks or eight weeks of training for a 2K. Just think about how much time you can drop on that. Okay, so with your pull, guys, what I want you to do now, so we did scap push-ups before, meaning that arm stayed straight. We let the shoulder blades come together and spread back apart. We're now gonna do a scap pull-up where you basically do the opposite. So for me, I'm gonna hang and I'm gonna draw my shoulder blades back down together. So there's no actual pull of the elbow. I'm using my scaps to move my body. Give me 10 of those. Now you can do that again with whatever pull you cut you have. So just 10 of those. Okay, now, are there any questions about how this workout is going to work? Because if not, we're gonna get this thing cranking, all right? We're gonna start doing this workout here. Because I wanna make sure to respect your time, and I think we're gonna get a great workout out of this. Um, so I'm gonna give you guys a chat, chat a, 
I'm going to give you a chance to catch up. <laughs> Any questions on how the workout's going to work? Again, so every minute we will be working. It's going to be 20 minutes of work. And every minute you're either we're going to be doing five, five push-ups, 10 pull-ups. Hold on. Five pull-ups, 10 push-ups, 15 air squats. And you're going to be doing two exercises each minute. So minute one, for example, we will do five pull-ups, 10 push-ups. Okay. Then the next minute, we will do 15 air squats, five pull-ups. Minute after that, so on and so forth. Okay. So we're always lumping two movements together. Does that make sense? Okay. So you're going to have to keep moving here. Believe me. Within five minutes, I think we are going to start seeing it. And if you don't, if you miss the ref schemes within a minute, not the end of the world, all you're going to do is just do what you can in that minute. And I would love it if you would stop with like 45 seconds left. If you feel like there's just no hope in finishing. Okay. If you're like, I am just, you know, I got whatever, 10 seconds left and I have 10 reps left. Just take a break, stop with 45 seconds, give yourself that 15 seconds to shake it out. And you'll just move on to the next exercise for the next round. Okay, so there's no harm in missing it. And then what happens if we miss it? Then the next time you come back to it, I want you to scale it back in reps. So let's say it's the 15 air squats, okay? And you're like, whoa, grinding them out. You're like eight, and you, you're basically running out of time. So you stop with 45 seconds left. You got eight, eight squats. Next time, when you get to squats, I want you to just set 10 as your mark, okay? That way you kind of manage the workout and, and mold it into what you are able to do. I hope that makes sense, okay? So I'm going to run this off of my watch today. I've learned my lesson that it helps to have a watch instead of staring at my computer across the room with a stopwatch running. Um, in all honesty, I'd lost the charger for this thing <laughs> for a few weeks, so that was why I had no watch. Okay, I've seen no comments roll in. We seem to have everybody here geared up, ready to go. And so we're gonna get this workout started. Again, it's starting with five pull-ups, 10 push-ups, 15 air squats. On an air squat, I want that chest up nice and tall. Push those hips back, keeping the chest tall. Hips come below the knees. That's the goal for the squat with weight evenly distributed amongst your feet. On the push-ups, I want chest to deck, elbow extension at the top, okay? Not half, not half. Okay, and I want hands just outside of the shoulders, not super wide where we're doing this thing or super close. Okay, just right outside of the shoulders, full chest to deck push-ups, if you will, please. And then on the push-up, I want chin over bar. If you have a bar, again, everything's modified. And if the pull if the push-ups get hard, what's up? You're having trouble pushing it overhead? You can't do it on the carpet. Well, you can come do it on the rubber with me if you want. Right there. Try it. Okay. You want a different one? Which which color? No, I need to pick one for you. Oh, you're going to pick one for me? Okay, pick one for me. Purple or the green. You tell me, which color? Purple or green? You want pink? You want pink? Yeah. Okay, take it. There you go. All right. Daddy's got to start the workout now, okay? Yeah. Okay, you can you can keep both bands, all right? Okay. All right, guys. I saw a couple comments, but I'm assuming most people are, I can't think that well when I'm sweating. You're going to have to today. <laughs> but don't worry. I'm going to be doing it with you so you can follow along with me. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, go. All right, that's minute one. So again, every minute we will start a movement. Denise, since you're since you're on couch today, you can help us remember what round we're on. You can be our our ref or our judge as we go through it. Okay, so this time we're gonna do 15 air squats and then five pull-ups. Okay. Three, 
Going in five, three, two, one, go. Okay, we're in it now. Guys, we're two minutes in. Only 18 left. Okay, 10 push ups, 15 air squats. Five, three, two, one, go. I think this is round three, right? Yeah, that was the third round. So next, we're back to five pull-ups and 10 push-ups. Five, three, two, one, go. My Achilles, for some reason, feels tight. It's a weird thing to feel tight. Okay, come on. <laughs> so now we're doing 15 air squats, five pull-ups, or five rows, or five whatever your modification is. 10 seconds. Five, three, two, one, go. Can you do your own? This, this one might be so high. Here, hold on to these. You're getting strong. Okay, so we're going to do 10 push ups, 15 air squats. Five, three, two, one, go. Fifteen. Okay, five pull-ups, ten push-ups. How's it feeling right now? There are a lot of flies in here right now, aren't there? I'll put it all the way down for you. 
Might still be a little too big, so please be careful. Oh shoot, where do we leave off? Oh, five pull-ups. <sighs> Ten push-ups. Okay, here, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna come hold the rings right here, like right where I am. Hold the rings. Okay, you're gonna lean back and pull yourself to the rings. Pull with your arms. 15 air squats, five pull ups. Pull with your arms. Two, one, go. Hey, water, it's a hot day. Yeah. 10 push ups, 15 air squats, 10 seconds, five, three, two, one, go. No? Okay. I'll change it in a second. I think that's 15. Change it again. Can we go all the way back to the beginning? There you go. Okay. Five pull ups, 10 push ups. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, I'm getting burned on the push ups. One more. Ah. Feeling it. Yeah, that's the halfway mark. 15 air squats, guys. Denise, you're doing a great job of keeping track of rounds. Going in five. Three, two, one, go. Raise your hand if you can't do one pull up yet. Guys, you're doing great. Promise. 
five, three, two, one, go. Seven. Again, guys, it's all about modifying. Scale, modify to your abilities, okay? It's okay if you don't have pull-ups. It's okay if you don't have push-ups. It's okay if you don't have a full air squat. It's modifying to progression so that you can hopefully improve the more you practice working towards it. Three, two, one, go. Hey. Three. Six. Eight. Nine. Uh, we are in the meat of it guys 15 air squats 5 pull ups 5 3 2 1 go Hey, lots of water consumption today. Uh, I'm out of water. Yeah, 10 seconds. Starting on the push ups. Three, two, one, go. Eight. Fifteen. Starting to push it close. Uh, Ten seconds to the pull up. Five, three, two, one, go. Ooh. Needed that kick on the last one. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Boy, I'm getting worked, you guys. 
five, five, three, two, one, go. Three. That was questionable whether my chin got over or not. Back to those push ups. Ten seconds. Five. Three, two, one, you want more what? Hold on. Yeah. Ah, pink and red, huh? Nine. Uh, what thing? Um, what about a marble? I'm sorry, sweets. This thing? Boy, this? And go. That's three. Hold on, sweets. That is almost done. Toss it. Good job. All right, I'm definitely not getting through these push-ups. So, <laughs> thank you for giving me a reason to rest. <sighs> Six, three, two, one, go. So last minute, guys. Oh, hold on. I'm finishing right now, okay? Be patient for me. In the house? Okay, go ahead. Three, four, uh, one left. Five. Wow. Uh, yeah. That was something. That was something. Guys, here's the unlock. Please don't die. We like you need help. <laughs> Just forever person. Still able to keep it with Shane on five percent getting lower. Yeah. Give it up, man. Cheers from Peru. Thanks, Daniel. I can sort of kind of do one more like a chin up because of the tree branch. Hey, you're doing a tree branch? That's amazing. Kiss, dude, I'm glad you're smoked. Oh, I'm smoked. Oh, let me adjust this here. Hey. Told you we didn't need 30 minutes. 
Feel that. Enjoy that pump, you guys. <laughs> uh, love weighted pull-ups with toddlers, teenagers, not so much. That was harder than I thought, triple cap. Yeah, this is intense. You're back. Good job. You got your baby? Guys, and where was James for this one, right, Orsi? That's what I'm talking about. He said he was all excited for this 30-minute EMOM. Guys, I am drenched in sweat right now. Whoa, that 20 was an eternity, and I am bummed I did not get my push-ups for that second to last for minute 19. I was thought for sure I was going to get it. Dan did 20 miles on Zwift this morning. Dan, good job. I'm sure you'll watch the replay. You are pure evil, but I like it, Dan. <laughs> Scott, hi, Shane, Nate. Uh, it's Nate. I got my stickers today. They're awesome. Love it, Nate. Where are you going to put them? I'm curious. I want to know, like, what are the best places that people put them? And also, take a photo of it and have, if you have an Instagram, you can tag me or tell your dad um, to post it on Instagram. Tag a picture once you post the uh, sticker on something. I want to see what you put it on. Um, Sophia, I figure out a pull-up situation in my home. Uh, Sophia, so remember, you can do a band. You can do a towel. It doesn't have to be a literal pull-up. A tree branch, if you if that's what you were doing, works really well. And you just modify, right? I consider a pull-up, you can get your chin over the surface. If it's a supinated grip slash chin-up, if it's a pronated grip, pull-up, I'm fine with either. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, on my back type in this, I could swim in this puddle of sweat. <laughs> yeah. That makes two of us. See, when I had to modify push-ups with band because shoulder and wrist hurting actually felt I did better with band. Great workout. Yeah. Well, I'm curious what you modified because what I find works really well. Um, is if you can tie the band around a surface directly above you and then you put the band around your waist and it helps to elevate you is actually a really great banded assist for push-ups. Um, Leah, thanks, question mark. Denise Shane, I want the old school double C2 hat. I will buy it, I promise. <laughs> I know, Denise, I have so much going on right now. There are so many things that I'm trying to do with the business from, you know, um, I got some secret project coming out that's related to all, everything we're doing here. So, um, but that's like one, there are new potential businesses starting. There's Dark Horse getting like launcher rowing and, and everything with the crew going and um, all of that. I promise, I, I know it's on the to-do list, but my to-do list is like four pages long. Um, let's see. Scott, I'm going to put it on my Chromebook. Beautiful. I want to see a photo. I want to see a photo. Uh, I think it's the best non-equipment workout for lockdown. You, you struggling? You got to push really hard to get it to click. Yeah. Once you line it up, you'll get it. You just have to push hard. Uh, I don't have a pull-up bar, so I did horizontal Batman pull-ups on my squat stand with a barbell in the cups. That's fantastic. That's a great option, triple cap. Um, and Okay. One second. I need to help with a, a baby situation here. You're so helpful. There you go. There's one. Do you want me to do the other one? There you go. She's all strapped in. Uh huh. Yeah, I get it. I get that. Um. Okay, so uh, Joel, I would agree with you. That was a good one. Um, Dad's putting his on his rower. Awesome. Um, Scott, send me. I want to see photos from both of you. Show me the photos of where they are. Post them on Instagram. Ooh, secret project. Intrigued. Ooh, unleash the secret. Kicho. No. We're just, we're just, I was just talking about generals right now. There is, there is a secret project coming. I don't like, I don't know if I want to talk about it because it's not finished yet. That's the thing is like, I, you know, we're talking about ideas at the moment. Are you having trouble pushing it? Sweets. Where do you want it? You want it over there with you? Okay, I need, I'm going to move it, and then I need five more minutes, okay? And then I will be available to you the rest of the day, promise. Right here, is this good? Right there, okay. Okay. So, anyways, yeah, secret project, but I don't, I'm not, like, it's not finished. So I don't know if talking about it is, like, a great idea yet. Um, Oh, I've done the first four lessons. So stoked. Joined the crew yesterday. Love it. Hubby caught me trying to do the whole intro series at one go. Had to drag me away from the road. <laughs> I mentioned in there, you could probably do a lot of those workouts in one day. Next Friday, push-ups with kiddo. Uh, negotiating with a two-year-old. Love it. Yeah. Welcome to my life. So 
I guess, okay, well, there's a secret project coming that has to do with everything that we've been doing here. You know, I was talking about it a couple of weeks ago. Um, and uh, Oviedo's there, you see him in there. He's actually um, involved with this. And we are, I mean, I don't know how much I want to talk about this. I'm going to, I'll say this Monday or Tuesday, I think I'll be ready to talk about it. We're looking for like people, something like that. Be ready, Monday, Tuesday. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, we'll be here to talk about it. Um, that's all I'll say for now, because <laughs> I'm not ready yet. Kitch, are you are you ready? Um, oh, thank you. If, uh, yeah, I don't know, I can't, I can't. Details aren't finished, they're not finalized. So we'll talk about it then, get excited. Uh, with that, guys, I hope you had a fantastic workout. Um, yeah, y'all are amazing. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. I know I am excited for the weekend. I am smoked right now. It has been a long week. Uh, and, um, but better we wait. Yeah, yeah, uh, we will. We'll wait. We'll wait till Monday or Tuesday. We'll, we'll talk about it then. We'll talk about it. Um, I'm smoked. I'm ready for a couple days of no working out. And uh, yeah, that's what it is. Uh, Shark Life, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 11 a.m. PST, Tuesday, Thursday, 8. Uh, however, you know, stay tuned for, for potential changes on that. Uh, stretch and hydrate, everyone. Thanks for this week, Shane. You're welcome. Erica, thank you. Thank you. See you Monday. You're a king. Thank you. Danny, appreciate you. Thanks for an amazing workout. Kitch, so happy you were here. Uh, Jarell, have a great weekend. Thank you. You too. Thanks, Coach. You're welcome, Joanne. Robbie, thanks, Shane. Have a great weekend. You too, Robbie. Ron, thanks, Shane. Have a great weekend. Shark, Shark Life. That's a fantastic name, by the way. See ya. Shark Life. Glad you were here. Charlie, you're welcome, and I uh, love you all. Have a fantastic weekend, guys. Bye.